I have a case uh, that was about four years ago. It was very, very severe gum disease. All four molars are mobile. Patient was going to have them, like there are recommendations for extraction, and then he was devastated. When, at the time, I was also a very beginner at that, so I wasn't sure if we can save it, so I actually tell patient we can try. Theoretically, it should work, and I told them, uh, you're my first couple case. So it's kind of interesting. He, uh, he is a very good patient. He uh, follows the protocol really well. I, what I did is I followed the protocol too. So I didn't do anything extra or stuff. And then three months recall, we see that really the gum is pink, healthy, firm. And then at six months, we took one x-ray. We see a little bit of bone growth, but not a lot. Um, it's kind of like hardly see any. Uh, nine months, we took another one. We see actually some bone growth, and we are excited. At one year, we, we took another one. We see that couple of teeth, there are one teeth between the two roots. The bone is very, very low. And then we see a completely bone fill to the furcation area. And then it's actually very important for the furcation to fill by bone because it's, if not, it's hard for patient to maintain them. At this point, patient is gum disease free now. We, uh, we checked, we probed, there was no like deep pocket at all. It was like, it was never there. <laughs> the best thing is uh, we saved all four molars for him. And uh, we, we did some occlusal adjustment and he has like ugly fillings and we made a beautiful onlays for him. Yeah, he's happy and yeah, we are, we're both happy. <laughs>